The Diablo Pyramid is part of a palace complex on a very high ridge, 160 meters above the city of the Maya civilization called El Zotz. When we began to explore looters tunnels that had been made some decades before, we located and began to see evidence of finely modeled and very dramatically painted stucco. The stucco masks are about five feet high. Each one shows an aspect of the sun god with headbands and crowns of rulership as he goes through his daily passage. The sun was for them a key element of Maya rulership. It was an icon which they linked very deliberately to royal lives and royal identities and royal power. This is how the Maya would implant a dynasty in the landscape, by taking the body of a deceased king, placing him into one of these temples, and then through this linkage to the sun, there would be this continual restatement that this dynasty has arrived and that it has a secure foundation in that landscape. The Diablo Temple is one of the most ambitiously decorated buildings in ancient America. And we have to remember that this building was painted an intense red. That would simply catch fire at dawn and at dusk and would be visible from a long, long distance as well, more than any other feature of the landscape. It was this tangible statement of royal power and of its rooting in a dynastic founder. The only reason these stuccos are so well preserved is because they are from a building under that of the final layers of the El Diablo Pyramid. The Maya interred these stuccos with great care. We have to understand it as the Maya most likely did. The systematic mutilation of the breathing apparatus of these beings tells us that the Maya thought of these stuccos as living beings. This means that we're not only looking at them, but they are looking out at us. This has been a Brown project, of course, but it is also a collaborative project with the Guatemalan government that sponsors and supervises our research. It allows us to train some of the most exceptional graduate students in Mesoamerican archaeology. El Zotz has afforded these students opportunities to hone their craft and become the leaders of tomorrow in this field.